Well, YouTube is official. Raphael Warnock has been re-elected to the U.S. Senate. Georgia has re-elected Raphael Warnock. So far, 97% of the precincts are in. 1.721 to Herschel Walker's 1.6 million. This is ironic because you see, if, when you see 1.6 million people voting for Herschel Walker, you know, it just tells you that the people are just voting because of the party. They're not voting because of he's Herschel Walker, the man who's going, to rep or who's going to represent or was going to represent Georgia. It's just 1.6 million people who voted for Herschel Walker because they want the seat. That's just it. I mean, I, I would hope that those people who voted for Raphael Warnock sat down and looked at what he did for Georgia or what he has done for Georgia. And and that's the way you're supposed to look at a senator. That's the way you're supposed to look at people when you're voting for them. What have they done for your state? What have they, you know, do you see your state better off in better off in these last two years than they were two years ago before Raphael Warnock took office. That's what you got to look at. Um, and if you see that he, he that he hasn't done anything and nothing has been done, then you, can, you you know, you vote against him and you vote for the other guy. You know, but it's a shame when you see that the Republican Party actually <coughs> voted for Hershey Walker because of the seat. Because they don't care anything more. They don't think about how, what happens to Georgia. They don't care about, they don't, they don't care anything about that. They just wanted that seat. You know, when you see a man who has advocated for life, a man who says that he, he's against abortion, you see him coming back and you see how he pays for an abortion. You see that he doesn't even, he doesn't even live in the state of, of, of Atlanta. You see how he never spent time with any of his kids. So how is that conservative? How is that, how is that, how is his views, your views? It isn't. He's another, he was, you know, the, the sad thing about it is that he was um, handpicked by Donald Trump. He was told by Donald Trump that he was going to win. And Herschel Walker, not knowing any better, thought that he actually was going to win. But I, like I said before, it's sad that 1.6 million people voted for Herschel Walker to be in the Senate. Then what, was Walker was, what was he going to do in the Senate? Sit down and fiddle on his thumb? Because he's out of his league, obviously. And what it means out of his league, I mean, you can you can talk stats with Herschel Walker. You can talk football stats. I'm actually talking with Herschel Walker. You can talk about football by Herschel Walker. But when it comes to politics, you cannot talk to Herschel Walker about anything because he would not understand. You know? He doesn't come from where you or I come from. None of that happens to him. And for a man who's never been there for his family, for a man who has domestic violence, for a man who's took out a gun on his wife, on his ex-partner and his ex-wife, Threatened to kill her. Is that the man that you want to send? Even if he, even if he is reform, even if he, even if he's a, a man of God, a man of God wouldn't run for president. A man of God wouldn't run for, for, for none of this. Because a man has got the man of a man of God's job is to go around the world and preach the word of God to help our brothers and sisters who help to help the poor. That's what a man of God is. But just once again, it just shows you how people are. They're voting for the party. They're not voting for the person. What the you know, the person can say anything they want to say. They're gonna do whatever they do. But once they get once they get elected, they'll do the opposite. Trust me. But I've seen that Warnock has gone straight. Warnock has done the right thing. So why can't you know? I'm trying to know. It's just it must be. I congratulate, I congratulate people in Warnock. I congratulate everybody in 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 the state of Georgia that voted. Whether you voted red or blue, it doesn't matter. At least you voted. But it just amazes me that you voted, you know, Republicans voted for because, Republicans voted because of the the the, the, the party. The lieutenant governor said that that, that uh, Hershey Walker is the worst candidate they ever had. At least he was honest. At least he was honest. Abbott couldn't even do that. Abbott couldn't even say, you know what? I'm not going to vote with him. I'm not going to go, I'm not going to go campaign with him because I don't feel that he's the right, he, I don't think he's the right candidate that's going to represent the people of Georgia. Anyone can represent red, the red or blue, but it takes someone to represent the state that you're in. And Hershey Walker was not that. Hershey Walker was the puppet for the Republican Party. <clears throat> Hershey Walker was a puppet for Donald Trump, and sadly it cost him. And I'm glad that Warren is there. And after six years, he hasn't done anything. He's got to get out. 
Plain and simple. Plain and simple.